Hi guys, welcome everybody. It's freezing. All right, can you believe the weather today? So today I'm actually in Chapel St. Leonard's and we're in, in like the new area of Chapel St. Leonard. It's called Trunk Lane, uh, where all the caravan sites are and uh, all the amusement arcades, pubs, restaurants and everything. Yeah, so the shops as well down here. Uh, not a lot of people actually know about this place. When I came years and years ago when I was a kid, there wasn't a lot down here. But now, yeah, there's loads of stuff. Right, as you can see behind me, we've got thousands of caravans here. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to walk down the main street, down Trunk Road, showing you uh, all the caravan sites, uh, showing you the names of the sites. So if you're actually interested in coming staying in Chapel St. Leonard in the summer, uh, give them a call. Yeah, so take the names down, give them a call and see if there's any availability for you guys. But uh, yeah, it's not too bad. It's not a very, very busy place. In the summer, it does get really busy. Uh, I came last year and the road was packed out, but that was when it was really nice sunshine and on a Saturday night. But uh, during the week, it quiets down a little bit. But yeah, lovely beach. So and it's not too far from the sites to actually walk to the beach. So let's go for a walk down Trunk Road, Chapel St. Leonard's, showing you what's actually ha happening down there. So yeah, let's go for a walk. So also don't forget, if you like what you see, don't forget to hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell and give us a thumbs up if you like it. Right, so yeah, this is Chapel St. Leonard's. This is the Anchor Lane side. So as you can see, I, you know, there's loads of stuff to do down here, believe it or not. A lot of people actually come down here. Uh, you've got cafes, you've got uh, shops, you've got uh, arcades. Yeah, you've got all sorts down here. There's a few pubs, there's a few restaurants, uh, a few places where you can go and watch the football and stuff like that. So yeah, one time a day, there's nothing down here. But now, as you can see, it's a very popular place so yeah this is chapel st leonard so you've got the old town of chapel st leonard's and this is actually the uh, like the newer side of it yeah so as you can see loads of shops can you believe this weather today though it's supposed to be one of the warmest days today and it's blooming rubbish absolute rubbish well who's we expecting a good weather with the sun out and it's not it's absolutely terrible <laughs> So I don't know uh, anywhere else in the country, it's probably red hot, but it ain't here. Yeah, so we've got uh, ice cream parlours, uh, I've got coffee shops and stuff. So yeah, not many people having ice creams today though, a little bit too fresh. But yeah, got the uh, Harry's Bar here, look. So I bet this gets really busy on a uh, summer's day. So yeah, check out the entertainment. Looks like they're having a Andy's auction there as well. <laughs> right, so this side of the road you've actually got Happy Days Holiday Park. And then on the other side, that's behind all the shops, you'll see in a moment when we walk down there, it's actually uh, Anchor Lane Holiday Park. Yeah, so if you come in to this place, uh, this is, I think this is called Trunch, Trunch Road as well, this is called. So that actually takes you down to the sea. There's actually a little boating lake down there as well. If, uh, if you haven't seen my video on Anchor Lane before, you actually see the little boating lake and the beach front as well. So yeah, take a look at that. Right, so it's a shame it's not uh, nice and sunny today. <laughs> the weather is atrocious today. And uh, oh my God, but it's really busy still though. Uh, we've just come from Skeggy and the roads are so busy. But I uh, noticed there's a lot of Notts County fans here today as well, uh, watching the football in the pubs. So I've just seen them all going down to the uh, the bar. I don't know which one they're going in, but we might have a quick look in. Yeah, so then we've got uh, Bibby's Amusement Arcade there, look. So uh, I've got the fun factory next to it. 
And then we've got the fun part as well. So yeah, if you come into uh, this part of uh, Chapel St. Lady and you're a bit worried there's not a lot here now, well, yeah, there is. There's loads of stuff here for people to do now. It's actually grown since we actually came here years and years ago. There was nothing down this road, I don't think. But now, yeah, it looks really good. So, yeah, a lot of people do actually visit this part of Chapel St. Leonard's now and come and stay on the uh, caravan sites. Yeah, loads of fish and chip shops as well. Gigham restaurant. Yeah, so they do Sunday lunches there, look. So just have a quick look at the prices. Yeah, so uh, you get you get breakfast breakfast there, small breakfast for three pound fifty. Up to uh, seven pound fifty for a uh, large breakfast. And across the road, you've got the. Uh, Happy uh, Happy Days Club. I think that's where all the uh, Notts County supporters was actually going in. And they've got Archer's Pub across the way there as well. And then this side we've got Stewart's Bar. So live entertainment, karaoke nights. So we must have a different uh, groups and bands on every night. And some clothes shops. And they've got the Indian at the end there, look. But yeah, I've been down here in the summer. It's been absolutely packed out. So in the six weeks holidays, it's, you know, you don't have to go to Ingemel Skegness because you've got everything here. Yeah, so across the way there, that's the Happy, Day, Happy Days Holiday Park. Yeah, so if you come to Happy Days Holiday Park, there you go. Yeah, so if you haven't been to uh, Chapel St. Leonard's before and you've booked a holiday, uh, yeah, and you think, oh my God. So hopefully this is actually showing you what's actually happening down here. I know it's not very busy at the moment, but come the summer and it will be absolutely packed out. Right, so there go then, guys, then. So that's the newer side of Chapel St. Leonard's. Uh, say where a lot of people actually come now uh, for all the entertainment and uh, all the big holiday resorts. So, uh, yeah, this is starting down the, uh, the bit where you'll actually come in. And you've got ha Happy Days Holiday Park. Not very happy today, though, because the sun's not out. But, yeah, we're close to the beach. It's only about a 10-minute walk to the beach as well. And the beach is absolutely, absolutely lovely down there. Uh, nice sands down there, nice and clean. Right, so we can see we've got the Archer's Pub in front of us. Happy hour, uh, £2.60 a pint. Not oh, it's the happy hour. But yeah, I've seen in the summer loads of people sat outside here uh, having the beers and having a good time. Plus the entertainment that's on as well. In a few weeks time it'll start to get a lot more busier uh, everybody's down here for the holidays in the static caravans I don't know if you can just see through there but it's actually Fancy Island just across the way there so yeah if you wanted to walk down the beachfront to Fancy Island it's not too far to walk probably take you about 20 minutes to get down there. But yeah, I brought you down here on a, uh, a quiet day, uh, Saturday afternoon, when the weather's not too good. But I uh, say, in a few weeks time, when the weather gets better, especially the hot, hottest day of the year, believe it or not today, and it's not, it's actually rubbish.
Yeah, so down here we've actually got the uh, a car park here as well. It's not too far from the beach. And uh, so you can park here and get yourselves on the beach. There's actually toilets as well. And also there's actually uh, a fishing lake down here as well. So yeah, as I said earlier, I actually did a little video of uh, Anchor Lane and I actually got the old uh, boating lake on there. So yeah, this is the way down if you're coming from Chapel Side. And uh, yeah, let's walk down there and uh, show you what's happening down there. Right, so we're actually doing a little walk with the family today. I didn't show you them earlier, but uh, this is Frankie. Yeah, so Frankie comes with us to Skegness every weekend, don't you, Frank? Yeah. Yeah, and do you like coming to Skegness? Sometimes. When I mean, it's sometimes. Cold. Not when, when it's, it's cold. cold. Yeah, a bit cold today, isn't it? Mm. But yeah, we have a good time, don't we, on the yeah. beach? Yeah. So yeah, loads to do for the kids. So yeah, me and Frankie have a good time on the beach on the paddle boards, don't we? Yeah. Right, we're coming down to the end of uh, where the Anchor Lane, uh, I, think, I don't know what it's called, Anchor Lane Leisure Park or Fishing Park. I'm not quite sure what it's actually called, but there's a lovely little uh, touring site as well here, look. You've got electric and everything, and the fishing lake as well. So yeah, that'd be a really nice place to stay uh, in the summer. Yeah, so this, this campsite here, this is right next to the beach, this is called Lake Lung Caravan Site. So yeah, it looks a really nice site. Uh, so yeah, straight onto the beach. Uh, electrical cup and the like, toilets and everything as well. So yeah, this is the car park. And then uh, just over there is the beach. And so there's a few tourers in there with the awnings up, come for the week or the weekend. Oh, what a terrible day today it is. So we're in May and the weather's rubbish. It's supposed to be one of the hottest days today and it's not. Yeah, so this is called Welcome to Horseshoe Lakes. So yeah, this is the fishing lakes. And also this is where the uh, little boats are. So yeah, if you didn't see my video before, I've actually done a video on this before. There was actually a little fun fair down there. And... Uh, how I brought you down here as well, so with the little boats on the water. So yeah, you got like a little sharp picnic area, cafe and stuff. A few things for the kids. But, uh, is the boats actually still here? They don't look like they're actually running anymore. Oh yeah, I've got some other, they're not... Uh, don't know if they're going or not. We'll have to find out. But yeah, these boats have been here since I was a kid. So yeah, mum and dad used to bring us from Inglemells all the way down here. And uh, for a walk, it's quite a fair way, a fair walk. I don't know if you can just see the amusements over at uh, Inglemells. But yeah, they're down there. Right, so we've just stopped at this uh, little cafe on the side of the boating lake and we're going to try a coffee and a cake. The cakes look really good. So yeah, let's see what they've got and uh, see what it tastes like, uh, what the price is like. So the wife's gone to fetch it for me. So yeah, let's have a look. Lakeside Leisure Menu. Yeah, so we've actually got a menu here and what they actually do at the little boating lake here. So yeah, get jack potatoes, burgers, sandwiches, baguettes, ice cream, coffees and teas, and even alcohol. Yeah, so this is a, an old photo of uh, what it used to look like years ago. The pictures aren't very good, you can just see them. So yeah, you can see what used to happen down here. Uh, this picture is a copy of the original advert taken from 1965, Chapel St. Leonard's Holiday Guide. Yeah, so a long time ago that was. You've got the uh, pictures of all the guys that's actually caught the fish on this lake. 
So yeah, if you're a keen fisherman, check those guys out. Oh, some good fish there. Right, so we've got this bit of cake here. So uh, what flavour is it? Rhubarb and custard. Rhubarb and custard cake. So as you can see, my wife's actually at half of it already. She can't wait to tuck in, but uh, this was uh, four pound, I think this was. Four pound? Yeah, four pound for this size of cake. So yeah, we hope it's good. So we'll give it a try. Right, so we're just gonna try this cake, yeah. So, uh, rhubarb and custard cake. Yeah, it just tastes of rhubarb and custard as well. But is it actually worth four pound? That's what the sponge is like. Mmm, a little bit dry. But it, yeah, it is nice. It is nice. Let's try this bit. Right, so we've just been in the uh, cafe. Uh, we've had a nice big uh, piece of cake, bit dry, bit dear. Four pound for a piece of cake, a bit too much. Two pound, 80 for a cup of coffee. Uh, also had an ice cream in there, uh, Vienna did. Uh, it's supposed to be vanilla and it actually tastes of rum, believe it or not. But yeah, not too bad, not too bad. So I bet in the summer when it's busy, it's uh, nice in there. So yeah, so that's the Lakeside Cafe uh, at Chapel St. Leonard's. Yeah, got a lot of memories down here. I say, if you haven't seen the video yet of Anchor Lane, it actually brought you down here and there was a few boats going around. We was going to take the kids on the little speed boats, but they're not actually running at the moment for some reason. But yeah, not a lot of the places open. The Little Moosement Arcade as well there, that's not actually open either. But yeah, we've been in the cafe there, had a coffee and a tea and a bit of cake, and the kids had the ice creams. Right then guys, hope you've all enjoyed that little walk down uh, Trunch Lane, uh, Chapel St Leonard's, where all the caravan shites are, what I showed you. So if you're coming here on a holiday soon, yeah, so uh, yeah, you, you've never been before, you've booked a caravan, you can actually see where you're actually coming to and uh, what the facilities they've actually got for you. So uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed that. So don't forget, if you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell and give us a thumbs up if you like it. Yeah, so we'll see you in the next video and we'll see you soon.